Rise and grind. What's going on everybody? Hope you guys having a blessed day out there. Staying busy, staying productive, staying on your grind. Everything's going good my way. Just got my hair braided. So I'm feeling fresh, feeling blessed. Got the temp fade on the sides and the temp fade in the back. Basically, the temp fade and the taper is the same exact thing for those that was asking. Fade is anything faded behind the ears that's, you know, more higher up. You know, they got the mid fade or they got the high fade. I usually rock kind of like a mid or a high fade. That's what I like. Taper is uh, cool. I do it in the meantime when I, I don't have time to do a whole fade or nothing like that. But yeah, that's basically what a temp fade is. As you guys can see in the back, it's faded up. The neck area is faded up and then uh, the side is blended out. And for those of you asking, you know, how do you clean your braids or how do you shampoo your braids in the shower? Well, the easiest answer to that is, you know, you don't. You know, I usually shampoo my hair once or twice a week. When you're in the shower and then you're shampooing your hair and you're messing with it, you're going to like detangle your braids. You make it look more frizzier, more messier. Once you got your braids already in there, don't worry about, you know, cleaning it like that. Just make sure you clean your hair before you get it braided. I only wear my braids maybe for one day or at the most two days and then I take them back out you know get it rebraided whenever I want to because it, it takes like five minutes you know? place about to go ahead and head out to the gym getting some biceps and triceps tonight baby let's get it I'm making magic you moving backwards I had to have it made it know what you take me as or understand the intelligence that Jay-Z has What's going on YouTube? Just getting back to my place. My bad y'all, my camera actually died when I was at the gym so I couldn't record my whole workout. I appreciate everybody who took advantage of the two for one special. So for those that don't know, there's a special going on right now on my website where you order two creams and you get one free. So you order two CP creams, I'm gonna include a free one for you, no problem and no charge. And it's free shipping available as well in the US, so order yours today. 
But for those wondering how to use the CP cream, make sure your hair is slightly damp with water or moisturizer. And you want to go ahead and take about two scoops. That's one, two. And spread it throughout your palms. All right, so once you got the CP cream all throughout your fingers and your palms, uh, make sure you spread it throughout your hair evenly. I mean, you want to get the front, you want to get the back, you want to get the sides. You want to make sure you spread it out everywhere evenly. You know, I see some people, they only put it in the front and don't get the sides or they put it in the back and don't get the front. You know what I mean? But first, make sure your hair is damp, spread it through your palms and apply it evenly throughout your hair. Yeah, for those that's wondering how to style your hair with the CP cream, it's as easy as that. Just make sure you guys, you know, dampen your hair with water. Right now, I got my hydrated mist spray. And then, you know, I apply the CP cream, you know, evenly everywhere. And then I style my hair. With you guys right now growing out your hair, if you got spikes or if you guys got the comb over or if you guys slick in the back, just make sure you know you guys are putting any kind of like moisture in your hair and using the cream to, you know, basically style and lock in that moisture. But yeah, I'm gonna wrap it with this vlog. Hope you guys enjoyed. Plenty more on the way, so stay tuned. Stay blessed.